John Krasinski sharing a smooch with Pete Davidson and getting arrested for participating in the Capitol riot earlier this month is not something we had on our 2021 bingo card, but Saturday Night Live continues to surprise us. Krasinski hosted SNL for its first episode of the year but couldn't seem to shake his office character, Jim Halpert. Krasinski took the stage to share how honored he was to host his favorite show, but the director of A Quiet Place was interrupted by questions about The Office from members of the audience. Hey, Jim. I have a question. Dot dot dot. So my question is your Jim from The Office, asked Alex Moffat before asking him where Pam was. Krasinski responded, nope, I'm actually John. Hello. He added that Pam is a fictional character. Ego Nwodam told Krasinski he needed to stop working out because Jim is soft. Keenan Thompson stood up and told the host he needs to kiss Pam. That is what I need to see today, Thompson said. Pete Davidson then showed up by Krasinski's side to explain that everyone was asking about Pam because they've been binge-watching The Office while quarantining. I think they really need for someone to be Pam, Davidson told Krasinski. I think we've got to give them what they want. Jim, I think you have to kiss Pam. Krasinski and Davidson then shared a kiss to cheers from the crowd. A few sketches down the line, Krasinski finds himself at a friend's home for a game night with five other pals in a quarantine pod. The friends are all sitting around the living room when the doorbell rings. Their friend Brad opens the door thinking it's the pizza delivery, but instead it's an FBI agent arresting Brad for participating in the U.S. Capitol riot on January 6. I care about our nation and its constitution, so I wiped jelly on a statue and put Nancy Pelosi's phone down my pants," Brad explained to his friends, who asked why he'd do such a thing. This cycle continued on, with the doorbell ringing and the friends thinking they're getting pizza when in actuality, it's more FBI agents arresting them one by one until it's Krasinski's turn. Are you Keith Reynolds? The undercover FBI officer asked Krasinski. Krasinski responded, yes, or Q Daddy on Facebook. He proceeds to leave with the officer, carrying what appears to be the lectern of House Speaker Nancy Pelosi, mimicking Adam Christian Johnson, aka Podium Guy, from the riot. Good day, all, Krasinski said as he left.